What does winning the O'Brien Award with Shower Play and the connections involved with her mean to you? It's just one word. Wow. <laughs> it was just amazing, very emotional. Um, we were in tough, obviously, with Kissing in the Sand. And um, I mean, uh, yeah, I think she deserved it because she beat her fair and square a few times. So, yeah, it means a lot to us. And she was just a $15,000 yearling and started out in the grassroots. Uh, and then she went on to win golds, the Fan Hanover Simcoe Stakes last year. Uh, can you comment on her development and what has been key to her success? Actually, as a two-year-old, we really thought she was the real deal. And Sylvain Fillion drove her. He drove her excellent, did a great job with her. He kept saying, you know, she's a gold filly, she's a gold filly. Um, at that time, we were up against Percy Blue Chip, which was pretty much dominated. And um, we kind of just thought, you know what, we're doing okay here, so let's stay here. And then she got sick on us, unfortunately. We had to shut her down. So, um, missed, once, missed the grass, uh, yeah, grassroots the final. final, but you know what? That happens, right? It's just you got to do what you got to do sometimes. I think apparently that was the right choice in the long run. The development as a three year old was like we started in the grassroots, of course, again, because um, the first goal was on a half. We said, let's just try her on the big track first, go from there. I, let's just say it worked out, you know, so yeah. Yeah, the funny part was uh, when we win the grassroots there, uh, the week after was the elimination for the fan handover. So we said, what are we doing? So we discussed about it and we said, hey, let's go for it. And I talked to Louis Philippe Roy and he said, I said to him, I said, you know what? We just came out of a uh, grassroots after this race. If she's good enough, let's go for it. But after this race, I still want to have a filly, you know, so don't go too hard on her. And, Next thing I know, finish second in the elimination, and next thing I know, she won the fan over. So that's the story after the grassroots. Yeah. And she did end up missing the super final. Can you share an update on her and plans for this year? Yeah, that was a little uh, deceiving. You know, she we couldn't finish the year the, the, the way we wanted. We had a little bump on the road, and you know what? Come to the, this race, we um, we were not sure what was going on, so we didn't want to take any chance with her. So we just quit with her. We have a lot of that involved, and uh, I think we did the right thing. And uh, for uh, 219, I think she's going to be there, and uh, she's uh, training right now, and uh, she feels very good. Well, congratulations, and enjoy your night. Thank, Thank you very you much. So much. Thank you.